Hi guys, I just want to show you how to make an electric brake for a three phase wind turbine with just a few simple pieces a three phase contactor, a normally household switch, and that would be a power supply which you won't be using there. And I have made up a pilot light. So here's it working. So it just shows you the energizing, the contactor energizing, and you'd have your, your, your cables coming in there from the wind turbine in the three phase. So that's the way it works there now and I'll show you how I did it just and here is where it is uh, crossing the phases here from one to the other there's three phases there see the three spaces there and so when you energize the contactor of you, which you use your switch that would let go of the brakes and you energize it and you can have any pilot light that's just a, just a, show, a reference to show you how it works I strip it down and I'll show you how I did it As you can see, I only stripped a small bit. So I'll just show you how I did it. Power here, so it's off there now. But wherever you get your power, get a, a supply. So this is a reference to show you. So having two tails, there's a neutral and live. So put my neutral in A1 of the contactor. There. So have a neutral going straight from the light, your main feed into A1 and then from A1 into your pilot light of your neutral. And then you bring your live, come up in here into your switch, out your switch and into A2 of your contactor. So I'll just put this in here. Now, so you have your neutral splitting into your pilot light, your live being broke through your switch, comes through here, out, and into A2. So, an A2, I'll bring a link over to your normally open contactor, and the same up here for reference up here to normally open. I can just show you better here. See normally open and down here normally open. So unless you energize the contactor, that one close the contact inside to give you a pilot light. So what I have done down there is I bridge the three them three phases. It's the same here. This is, so I will bridge them three there. And in here you'd have your three phases come from your wind turbine. So so when you energize it, the same thing again. No pilot light, so not in command unless you energize it with your switch. Right, didn't work there, it turned off. And um, there you go. Just a quick, easy, cheap way to make a tree phase electronic brake. Which you do need for your wind turbine, unless it's installed already in it, to keep the high uh, survival of the high winds. So, hope that helps you. If anyone's any help, I'll give you a hand. There's no hassle. Just to show you again. Turn off that. So your main power coming in along here. Your neutral into A1. And then your neutral spits into your pilot light over here. So that has a neutral already. And then your switch, your brake to feed. And in here, to A, to A2 so that energizes the coil inside and then your three phases in here from your wind turbine and then bridge them out here so they just cross so when you energize the coil you just all you're really doing is just crossing the three phases like that like that and it just locks it in and so you can do it any way you want you can have normally close contactor Normally close and normally open, and there are your two main feeds for your 
I'm gonna energize no coil. Okay guys. That's really it. You can get any small put a real small pilot light. You don't need the big light like that. Just a small pilot light is all you need to help it work. And I know your other safety precautions and you need as well, but you know that just a fuse coming from your main supply, switch fuse or whatever you want to do it. And that should fuse your your main feed coming in and the rest should be okay then. And that's all you need. Okay guys, thanks a million. Alright, talk to you again.